Alright, I am back for a quick little part. I don't know how long this is going to be, but I'm pretty sure it's going to be real fast, just like that other ending. So, this time, we're going to choose Betray and see how much of a jerk he can be. Round 2 results will be displayed in the warehouse. Thank you for your participation. And then Kay's gonna walk out. And the deck's gates now opening. And let's see if everyone hates my guts. Well, except Clover. Clover and I walked out slowly. Walked slowly out of the AB room. Dio glanced over at us as he exited his own room. I looked away before he could make eye contact. Sigma, why? After all that stuff you said. I mean, it's not like I'm criticizing you. I think you made the right decision. Sorry. You don't need to apologize. I think I would have chosen Betray if I was in your position. We'll find another way, alright? We just have to keep an eye on Dio. As soon as he gives us an opening, we take it. A and I'm sure Alice will help us too. Did you tell her? It's okay. We can trust Alice. There's no way she told him. Anyway, let's go check the results. Y yeah. I want to see what happens, actually. That's... something. Now let's punch Dio. Results from round two of the Ambidex game will now be displayed. Please check your bracelet to see your updated bracelet points. And then Kay walks out. Hey, what the hell is this? Sorry, I decided to choose Betray. Oh, so you don't care what happens to Quark? What kind of cold-hearted bastard are you? Jeez. Please, just give it back. Hey, Sigma, what are you talking about? We found an... Accelivir. We found the Accelivir in the laboratory. And Dio stole it. What? You mean he has it? Right now? Nah, I don't have it. What? Well, I won't have it in about two seconds. The moment the words left his mouth, I knew what he was planned to do. No! Don't! I leapt toward him as I spoke, but it was already too late. Dio snatched the vial out of his pocket, brought it up. And threw it to the ground. No! You bastard! What are you doing? A promise is a promise. Yeah, and a bastard is... If you'd chose an ally, this never would have happened. You want to blame someone? Blame yourselves. And I blame you for stealing it. Gah! I had an... I'd had enough. Something snapped in my brain. Bastard. Gah! Sorry. My nephew is across the... Across the... Uh, across, so I can't really scream tonight. I let out a guttural black roar and leapt forward. Only to be stopped by a short... by... by a... wait, only to be stopped short by a firm hand on my arm. It was Fi. Hold it! Why are you stopping me? Because this isn't the time for that. Huh? Kay is at the door. What do you mean this isn't the time for? Look at the number nine door. 
Kay. Kay was indeed standing in front of the door. What? What is he? No! Yeah, I think everyone else was, like, not paying attention that he had nine. Even the last time, no one paid attention, although Kay was kind of worried. His BP is nine. What? Suddenly, we were all running toward Kay and the number nine door. Hey! What the hell do you think you're doing? What am I doing? Well, that should be obvious. But if you insist, I am attempting to leave. Are you fucking kidding me? I assure you, I would do no such thing. I am perfectly serious. After a rational assessment of the facts, I have concluded that this is the wisest course of action. What is currently our highest priority? The answer is, of course, to save Quark. He must be taken to a hospital as soon as possible. Is he going out to try to save Quark? Does that make for any that sense? Happen, one of us must escape and call for help. Oh, yeah, okay. Currently, the only one of us capable of doing so is myself. Oh, okay. That is why I intend to escape. Okay. And leave us all behind. Unavoidable. But as I said, I do intend to call for help. Okay. Couldn't you have at least waited until the next round? Then you could have raised Quark's BP to 9 and taken him with you. And what would happen if Dio was Quark's opponent in the next round? I have no illusions about what Dio would do. Yeah, really. That's true. This is the most logical choice. The number 9 door has been opened. It will remain open for 9 seconds. Yes, Alice is in the AB room. She has collapsed, but you needn't be concerned. Oh yeah, she collapsed. She is only sleeping. Oh no, what did you do to Alice? You will need to ask her yourself. I must take my leave. Hey, God damn it! wait! Dude charged at K, but the larger man easily sidestepped him and tumbled nimbly through the door, just before it closed. The number 9 door has closed. This ends the Nonary game. Thank you for your participation. As the game is over, all doors other than the number 9 door have been unlocked. Escape is not possible. Please enjoy your stay. I love how Sigma just faded out there too. <laughs> game over. And that's what happens if you pick a, 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 a betray, betray, and K goes rescuing. Yeah, rescuing. It's a game over for a reason. He don't don't succeed in the rescue if he even wants to rescue. Although this right here is still kind of no, not that that because it doesn't have that anymore. So I'll be right back. Or, no, I won't be right back. I'll catch you all next time, and I hope you all have a great night.